We went to a different grocery market this time because my dad thinks this one's more likely to have boneless chicken feet than the Zong He that we usually go. Yes! Oh, cool! Okay, this is the boneless chicken feet. Yeah. Oh, it wasn't even frozen, huh? It frozen. Oh, it was? But yeah, I just thaw that with water. You just thaw it with water. the water. No bone. Nice. One piece is too big, so I usually cut in half. Oh, you can take your mask off if you want, Dad. Oh. And then you're just throwing it in water. How come? It's too frozen. Oh, just to help thaw it more. Okay. Yeah. Is that hot water? No, just cold. Cold water. Okay. Let me a bone on here. Hmm? This is the first time I've seen you without flip flops. <laughs> yeah. It was just windy enough that you deigned to put socks on. Yeah. Kind of cold. Mm -hmm. Just dirty. Oh, so you're cutting off the dirty parts. Yep. Wow. Please. Vinegar to clean it. Please. And salt. Okay. What do you What are you trying to look for when you smell it? See if it, it have any kind of smell to it. It, does, it shouldn't have any kind of okay, smell. Okay, it should be odorless. Almost. Almost. Yes. Okay. So, it shouldn't taste like a live chicken. It should be <laughs> okay. Cook the lamb chop. Okay, you're gonna season this. Oh, and let this sit here, and then cook the lamb chops while that's while that's marinating, basically. Yeah. Okay. This is chopped lemongrass. Already chopped. We cook two style, one with lemongrass and uh, pepper, and one with chai. Chai, which is here. This is a special kind of chai with the buff flower, not the regular chai. Ooh, my God, I'm so excited. So. Is that enough? Hmm? Yeah, it should be. This one, you do it with uh, black bean garlic sauce. Ooh. And of course, I need my cooking. I have to have some of these in there. In Coco Rico, everyone. Well, I, get, I get the liquid, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think that people have noticed your recipe pattern formula Coco Rico plus some kind of umami paste sauce. Oh, this is uh,
little bit. Oh, the mushroom powder. Okay. Mushroom you're, powder. you're almost out of it. No, I have more. Oh yeah, the whole bag. Oh, it's already open. Right here, yeah. Because that 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 black bean sauce mm -hmm. also salty. Okay. okay. With some oil, mm -hmm. a little bit of oil. When you season it, then let's get a zip lock. We need to mix in the zip lock. Mm-hmm. Let's throw it in here. One style. <laughs> one down. <laughs> Amazing. This one is lemongrass. Even you know, if you like a lot more lemon grass, it's good. Mm-hmm. You know. Okay. Yeah. There's uh, pepper in there too. Oh, the lemongrass already has pepper, okay. A little bit of pepper. Great. Okay. Of course, Puerto Rico. <laughs> Okay, so that has lemongrass oil. Lemongrass oil. Or I mean, it has lemongrass, cocoa, rico. You didn't put oil in there, right? I did. Oh, you did. I missed it. Mushroom powder. You're going to put a more le mushroom powder because nothing in here is salty. Mm, that makes the sense. other one here, the black bean salt, is kind of salty. Mm -hmm. Need more liquid because it's not mixing up evenly, huh? Yeah. Okay. Coco Rico should pay you. Hmm. And they go from like two ninety to four something. That was the price, wasn't it, last year? Four. Watch out! I don't know if it's closed all the way. I see a little bit stuff drip. Just make sure. Yeah. Okay. Okay. okay one last season. Let's do the lamb chop. Ooh, your favorite yeah. meat right now. Yeah. Look at these. What did you yeah. marinate it in? Uh, marinate with uh, steak rub, uh, rosemary, cognac, pepper. Rosemary is the uh, main flavor for a fast spicy. How long did you marinate it for? Oh, in the refrigerator, normally 15 minutes, but I'm in here five this morning, so I just did it. Good, with you this half side. Get her calmed down. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Red wine and barbecuing lamb chops. This is heaven. Yeah. I waited to be hot to seal the outside right away. I'm so excited. I really haven't had lamb chops in a long time. Yeah. Mm hmm. That's my favorite. Now I know. Than any steak. And I have to, I keep forgetting, I have to make on my to-do list to remember to order the wild boar for us to cook. Oh, yeah. I want to do that soon. That'll be fun. Oh, yeah, I remember why I didn't order it yet, because I knew I was going to be out Friday, and I want to make sure it's not delivered on a day when I'm not home, so I have to order it when I'm not traveling. Mm.
Oh, the lemon uh, for my it. lemon tree, yeah. pepper. And then what are you gonna do with that? For dipping the lemon? Layer. Yeah, oh. yeah. Sounds so good. I like that I can just like drink wine, <laughs> drink wine and watch you cook. I think that's why this is my favorite day of the week. Just like let daddy take care of me yeah. one day. The rest of the week, I feel like I'm uh, taking care of. They smell good. Oh my God, I can smell the marinade standing here. Mm. I can tell they're gonna taste good. It smells so good. Use what's it called? The Montreal, Montreal steak. steak seasoning, yeah. That one's good. So now you're gonna like leave it here for a little bit and then you're gonna flip it over? Yeah. Okay. About five minutes. Oh, that's fast. Yeah, because you don't want it well done. Yeah, of course not. Medium rare. Yeah. Open up, you put the meat in, and then you close it back. You wait for the temperature to get back to the original temperature. Mm -hmm. Probably it's about that time. I know you have no idea when to open it because yeah, you can't you, see. You make one, you know, like you see through. You know, mm -hmm. it's easy. The glass, the glass can take any temperature. Glass is very high temperature. Do you know if they have? I've never shot for barbecue grills before. Do they have? They must have barbecue grills with glass. Then you just maybe you just don't have one. I don't. I don't. I never. We'll check one. online. Oh, you know, I go to Home Depot. It's take all kinds of. Mm. I never seen one. Oh, so if they don't have it there, then maybe it doesn't exist. Have you seen? I was looking online that you know they have some refrigerators where the whole door is glass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Think about how. You would have to keep your fridge so neat. Yeah, I know. Because you if it's glass, that, imagine yeah. if like your fridge right now had a glass door, it would look horrible. Yeah. <laughs> Not ready yet. Yeah, All right. <laughs> you know what that means. <laughs> Ready? Almost ready? Almost. Okay. Ready for my alfresco dining. <laughs> I love that you're like no silverware. We'll eat with our hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah because you have the bone right here. Okay, perfect. Yeah. You just dip it in here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, just dip it in here. Yeah. See if you want to because I season it already, but sometimes. Okay. Oh my god, it's so good. Mmm. Mm. The marinade, the seasoning you have in it. You can taste the rosemary, right? Eh? Mm hmm. Definitely taste the rosemary. <laughs> well done. Chopped garlic, okay. Okay, I'm gonna try to turn it on. Right. I roasted this peanut this morning. Mm. That's a topping for the chicken feet? Yeah, for anything, for those two. Uh, You would have a hard time cooking. See where you miss? That's it. See? Yeah. Oh. That's amazing. Put a little oil in here. Oh, this one, you have a lot of oil. You know why? Why? Because this one is lemongrass and pepper. Okay. Because you have to fry this pepper. Oh, okay. Yeah. Pepper. You know why? Why? Because this one is lemongrass and pepper. Okay. Because you have to fry this pepper. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, 
by the tripper. They're not so fast. Yeah, wow, those, those peppers turn black fast. Whoa. I love that sound. Shoot, we, we forgot the, the garlic. Uh -oh. the so we're supposed to put it in the same time as the pepper. Yeah. Okay. I should have reminded you. I forgot you chopped it. Okay. Yeah, we blend it. Ooh. And we put some. It smells good. It's basically like fatty chicken skin. That's why it tastes so good. <laughs> Just a little bit of oil. Okay, yep. This one needs less oil so it doesn't have the lemongrass. when it's too wet, huh? Oh. Okay. So then how do you know when to take it off the heat then? Well, I think about five minutes to be good. Mm -hmm. The time it looks like this. The, the fat from the chicken coming out. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's good. Then you put the chai in. The reason the chai is why you it because it's very sweet. Ooh. That's the sweetness to it. Oh, it's so beautiful. Yeah, then we will put the chai. Okay. Smell that. Smells so good. What Emma Rose say? Smell. Mm -hmm. Bam, bam. Mm -hmm. We just remembered the peanuts. Lemongrass, cilantro, pepper, peanuts. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so decadent. Hmm? It's so good. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah. mm. Oh my god. Let me, let me try this chai flavor. Chai and black bean shock. Mmm. Oh my god. Wow, it's crazy how different they taste. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thanks for watching. <laughs> hope you uh, hope you learned something new. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to hear about you guys cooking chicken feet at home. <laughs>